So Daisy, just going for our usual stroll. Here you've got some exciting news. What is it? Yeah, so signed on for another four years. Um, yeah, pretty stoked. So it's good to get it out of the way and um, just focus on playing some footy now. So it's good. So four years, obviously a long contract. What made you stay? Yeah, I, oh, just the club that we're at, the people. Um, yeah, just love everything about it and the culture. And um, when I talk about the people, not just the players, just all the way through the staff, um, the people working upstairs as well. It's just an awesome environment and yeah, loved it since I've got here. Like you've obviously got family in Adelaide, friends in Adelaide, and there was a bit in the media about you potentially going back and obviously there were a few clubs chasing you. What did it mean for you and your family that you could lock in a long-term deal here? Yeah, I mean, there was a bit of outside noise and um, yeah, a lot of stuff in the media, but at the end of the day, I do love the club. My family has felt welcomed since I've come and um, yeah, there wasn't really any thought at all of leaving and it's just great now that I can commit to the club and now we can all build from here. Hey, how you going? Hey guys, how are you? Yeah, good, good thanks. Uh, can I just grab a latte? Rock, paper, scissors. There we go. That's a dub. Cheers. Thank you. Thanks. Lost the rock, paper, scissors. Pretty standard. How have you found your journey so far? Yeah, coming in um, straight into a COVID year was, um, at the time, thought it was as normal because I didn't know any better. But um, yeah, since then, um, getting back to normality has been awesome. Playing in front of crowds and um, really getting the full experience. Um, yeah, I'm just loving it each year after the other. Is there been anyone probably throughout your first couple of years that you've really lent on at the club? Yeah, I think early on, um, Jack Gunson and Luke Bruce really took me under their wing and um, a bit more recently Adrian Hickmont's been awesome for me, uh, my mentor at the club and he's just really instilled a lot of belief in me and been working really close alongside him. Now yeah, with our young side, who's really impressing you so far this year? Yeah, we got heaps, um, like Cam McKenzie to come in and have the impact he's had and Josh Ward going a bit under the radar at the moment but he's playing really consistent footy and then you got guys like Connor McDonald, Sam Butler, um, yeah just to name a few but we've got some pretty exciting guys coming through which is another reason why I was so happy to sign on. Yeah and these younger guys they're obviously look up to you as one of the younger leaders what do you do or like how do you help them out? As I said earlier just training standards little things like that just when you're young you probably think that you've got it down pat but like for me getting a bit older I now realise that um, there's another step to be taken all the time so probably just trying to help them see that as quick as possible because even though we're young so to speak we're trying to get there as quick as possible and we don't use that as an excuse. Yeah mate well for myself absolutely so proud of you dominating on the track this year but it's not just these three weeks that you've been really good you've been a great person for the club the last four years and to have you for four more is an absolute pleasure mate so proud of you and anything more you got to say for the Hawks fans no nah, just um thanks to everyone i'm stoked to sign on for another four um really excited about where the group can go and yeah we're building something special so really stoked